All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. So I am continuing the reading that I was doing in the live. Okay, the link to that live video is going to be in the description below. So if you want to see a longer reading in terms of this love reading, click that link in the description. All right, so give me more messages for my collective about this person. Okay, so this one came out in the live reading. So I was saying in that live that you guys are very gifted. Some of you guys are not aware of this. Others of you are aware of this. Uh, there's something about you guys having a lot of spiritual power. And it could be talking about your uh, DTs and your angels or one or the other. I feel like it's both because we had yin yang come out in the beginning of the reading. So you have a lot of duality. messages for my collective okay this person that you're about to meet is a tycoon okay that did come out they could be a tycoon in this type of work so construction trades uh more so of the physical labor type of jobs they could be someone who owns a company in trade work or they are a boss in some type of company we have one step at a time. So it was definitely talking about you guys being hesitant to give this person a chance. Um, they will definitely take it slow with you. This person had strong Virgo placements. Yeah. So a lot of you guys have not uh, explored this. Okay. You have hidden gifts that you haven't explored. So... Some of you guys are going to tap in. Others of you might literally go for the rest of your life not being aware of this. So take that as it resonates. They want to know everything about you. Okay, so this person is definitely curious. What the hell? Why does the screen look like that? Okay, never mind. I think I was just going too close. So yeah, they want to know everything about you here. So this person is fascinated by you. I was getting that in the first reading. That this person is intrigued by you. This is someone that you're either going to meet online or in public. Give me more messages for my collective about this person. We're going to use a different deck. Give me more messages about this person. difficulties will soon be a thing of the past so some of you guys are fucking stressed here and i was seeing that in the live reading I was talking about your hardships with money so some of you guys are struggling financially just know that there is a new beginning and i feel like for the most part there was something about this person um changing your life financially because we had i will change your life and i feel like this is what they're conveying to you so, like I said, if some of you guys are struggling financially, this person has some type of connection in a job that you might like. So, take that as it resonates. Yeah, there's something about you guys being very fearless and you're a go-getter, but I feel like it's also talking about this person because we had your person coming out as a tycoon in the beginning, and I feel like it's talking about them. Make the card flip or fall out. Thank you. That's too many cards. Give me one or two cards, please. Let me just shuffle. Give me one or two cards. Make a card flip or fall out. Thank you. So what do you want? 
So they could be asking you this, like, what do you want in a relationship? Or you could be asking them that. I feel like you're asking them that. Because I feel like in this reading that I just did, it was really talking about you guys having trust issues. So you're trying to figure this person out. You want to know their intentions. They definitely do want a long-term relationship. Yeah, you guys are very cutthroat. Some of you guys have a lot of tattoos. Take that as it resonates. It could also be talking about them being very cutthroat. They were coming off as very old school in the live reading. So this person is very traditional. Yeah, this person has a crush on you. All right, give me more messages for my collective. Make the card flip or fall out. <coughs> give me one or two cards. Give me one or two cards, please. Thank you. Okay, some of you guys have the ability to manifest things, places, or people through music. This is technically magic, okay? When I see this card, it's like you're enchanting. Um, whether you're singing along to that song or you're, you're manifesting it through your thoughts, music is technically magic. I don't care what nobody says. When you're listening to music, you, you better be careful, especially. So depending on what type of music you're listening to, you are definitely attracting something into your life. So use it to your advantage. Uh, we got, they love the little things about you that you don't notice. So this is how they feel. Okay, so like I said, we had the Three of Cups come out in the first live reading. And it's definitely talking about you meeting them in public uh, for the most part. So you might meet them at some type of event. Okay, so if you want to see that full reading, the link is in the description below.